Okay. One, two, three. Hello, everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Baldur's Gate 2 The Shadows of Om. My name's Heliax, and last time we escaped Aranicus's little, um, I guess it wasn't his asylum, but the asylum he took over, into the Underdark. So that's where we're at now. Aranicus also escaped. Uh, we, we drove him off using a lot of help from the other maddened individuals of the asylum. So we are now here. And real quick, I don't know if it's going to be any different, but just in case it is. I do have, I, I got myself a new desk, a new setup, and everything, so my mic's in a different location. Shouldn't make any difference, but just in case there's a difference, that is the reason why there is one. Maybe it's a good difference, though, so that'll be nice. Yeah. But anyway, we are now in the Underdark, and it is very dark. Look at that. So, which is Viconia's homeland, so hopefully she'll have some good, good information for me. Now, we are tired and wounded. Which is obviously not good. And we cannot retreat back. There's no portal back. So that's worrisome. Um, a part of me thinks we should rest. But before we do that, we're going to scout out just a little bit ahead. Because there might be like, I don't know, a friendly person for us to sleep with or something. I imagine it has to be an inn at some point in this place. Let's go ahead and turn this on so we know we can walk. Okay, we can walk up there. Okay, let's go this way then. See what we have up here. Mind flayers. Oh, that's lovely. <laughs> Two mind flayers right off the bat. Oh, boy. Okay. Never mind. Let's see what we have this way. Surely it's going to be more pleasant over here. Hello. I'm looking for an inn. Okay. Well, that's promising. They're not hostile. I'm waiting. tire of it's walking, done. I tire of talking, and I tire of this laughable body. I wish to <sighs> rest now. How long do you intend to crack your whip on my back? I say we stop. I know, guys. Now. I'm tired too. I grow weary. I'm tired too, but we have now. to find a safe place. I'm no use to anyone tired. So let's see. Maybe these guys are friendlies. Carling? Carlig, rather? Kordernor, Kordernor, Rin Doth Saman, Lilwela Luth, Wela Vagar Brarna, Luth Wound Nind, Kalorn, Elgin, Sarn Ustan Ulverconia. Ah, of, of course, Mala Viconia. I am at your service in all matters. Well, that's nice. Wait, wait. Carleg, she bears no house insignia that I know. Look at her companions. She is outcast. Aha! I shall treasure this moment. The proud drow humbled by a keen-eyed Duergar. Dwagar. Is it Duergar or Dwagar? I'm going to go Duergar. You dare. Morden dares nothing, I assure you. Though it is simply good policy to understand who you are dealing with. You must excuse my fellows, but it is not often that those not directly associated with the house pass this way. Yes, very seldom. They do not live long. Well, unfortunate things can happen in the depths, but we do not partake in such events. I am Karlig, a traitor of sorts. Okay, they seem pretty reasonable. Uh, I am Haliax. I am looking for a couple of other surfacers, as you say. Well, as you can tell, I am new around here. What should I look out for? I don't care. I just want to find the two passers I came for look came for and leave. Uh, what what should I look out for around here? Oh, most people will leave you alone if you are careful not to let them see you. <laughs> A joke, of course. I can't really tell you what to watch out for. I get along with most people, but I belong here. Your experience will be quite different. They can watch out for those two, you know. The neck biter and the mage. Oh, they know them. Oh, yes, those two. Bad news, I would wager. I've seen them near the drow city. Must be up to dirty dealings. Those old Mora dark elves don't usually let strangers live. Those are the two I'm looking for, Body and Ironicus. I'll have, I ha I'll have to go after them. Well, thanks for the warning, but I'll have to take my chances. 
Yes, well, the people I meet will have plenty to worry about themselves. I'm looking for those two. Well then, I wish you luck, though you won't be able to simply walk into the drow city. That place will come down on your head harder than a larg tunnel unshored. That's their choice to make, ben Finderlig. No need to worry them now. Ask about ask about before you go assaulting that place. It might be a better way. Ha! Well, in any case, I've wares to sell if you're interested. Always looking for fresh faces to trade with, no matter the color of shadow in you. I'll take a look. No, maybe some other time. I'm here, not here to shop. I'm more. Yeah, let's have a look. Okay, so what kinds of things do you have here in the underworld? I don't know why I'm saying it like that. <laughs> All this stuff is normal. Um, got some scrolls, some decent scrolls. I can't steal from you, I'm seeing. Which is a little worrying. I can't steal from you. I can steal. Okay, I just wasn't on the right person. Okay, do I want to steal anything? I mean, some of these scrolls are very, very good. Actually, these scrolls are amazing. You can probably learn most of them. Ooh. Yeah, we're probably going to do that then. We'll need to save beforehand. But let's go ahead and sell to you first. We got a couple of things you could potentially want. Two star sapphires. Black opal, sky drop gem. Oh, three rogue gems. That's expensive. Holy crap. Okay, I got some good stuff for you. Two diamonds. Actually, it seems like he's not paying as much as the surface does for these kinds of things. I don't accept fenced goods. Oh, shit. Which one's fenced? Ah. Is it this one? Yeah. Okay. Okay, well, that was a good amount of money. Anything in here I'm going to sell you? Um, I mean, if I'm not going to use these blades, I might as well get rid of them, right? Might as well, but we're going to hold on to them for now. <laughs> uh, Arrows of Dispelling, Black Spider Figurine. Okay, anything on you that I want to get rid of? Uh, do we need these? I don't think we do. I mean, we're going to hold on to them still. I'm such a hoarder. Okay, a lot of potions. We don't need these. Right, these are not better for me, so go ahead and sell those. Don't need any of those. Um, don't need Heart of the Mountain. Okay. Good. Body and Arenicus did pass through the Underdark. They may have been dealing with a drought to secure passage. Okay. Save it. Have a look what you have. Alright, so. Things we need to steal from you. We need a freedom scroll. Good. What else do you... I think there's one other thing you could learn. Spell sequencer. Okay, good. So let's give those to Edwin. Hopefully she memorizes them both on the first try. Fuck. Freedom is a level 9 spell? Holy crap. Wait, that's the, like, the mass freedom, right? Look at that. Note, cast a spell in an area where you know someone is imprisoned and they will be released. This is the reverse of the spell imprisonment. When a creature is imprisoned, he is trapped in a sphere far beneath the surface of the earth. If this spell is cast in the area where he was imprisoned, it will instantly free him and he will reappear exactly where he was standing when he was imprisoned. The spell kit will also cancel the effects of spell maze and return any characters trapped in the labyrinth of the plains. Okay, maybe it's not like the freedom spell. It's a little different, it seems. Yeah. Okay, well, that was 9,000 XP, so that's good. I'm there. All right. You have a lot of things you could learn, Emma Wynn, so let's go ahead and start stealing for you. Okay, so you need those three. Animate Dead, Cloud, Kill, and Cone of Cold. What else you got? Hold monster. Protection from electricity. Spell shield. 
Improved haste. So you need all you need all of these, okay. And that's all I can carry right now, so we're at power word silence. Okay. Here you go, take all these. So you can put this away. This too. We don't need those. That'll give me more space, that too. I guess this too. Okay. Now we don't have any potions of genius on us, right? We'll check that real quick so we don't potentially waste our time. None in there. I think you have a lot of potions. No. Yep, no. We have this we could give her. That's plus three. We don't want to waste that here. Might as well. <laughs> I mean, we haven't used it yet, so I mean, is it really a waste? Okay. Yep. That should help you. Let's go and learn these. Fuck. <laughs> Good. Good. Fantastic. Not fantastic. Good. Okay, that was pretty good. Look at the XP. That's doing math here. 26,000 XP right there. That's what? A few thousand XP for everybody? It's great. 38,000 left on Edwin. It's pretty good. And he's 93,000. Okay. Save it. Let's talk to him again. If it must be done. Go to Emma Wynn. Wait, she can learn freedom? Oh, well. Let's do one of those. Okay. You need all of these. Okay. There we go. Give all of these to her. Hopefully she succeeds at every single one of them. Because these are big spells. Be good XP for us. Okay. First up is freedom. 9,000 XP. 6,000. So that's 15,000. 21,000. 28,000. 34,000. This is going good so far. Uh, 41,000? My math is being tested here. 48,000 XP right there. Damn, that's good. That's some good XP. Juicy. Okay. Yeah. Thank you very much, Carl. Like, I really appreciate your help here. <laughs> it's probably best left. Well, let's take this stuff. Looks like it. Fender leg. Been pretty busy these last few days. You come through those other two? Bad sign it is. Why do you say that? Common sense. Outsiders always cause trouble. Nothing more to say about it, really. There will be no such trouble. I will be a guide. No offense, but trouble may find you, Maladrow. Is Malo like good? Good drow? I don't know. I would be careful in this place if I were you. Many dangers around many corners. You will be lucky to live. I myself have seen death here recently. Even the powerful cannot escape it. What are you talking about? Who has died? No real secrets for those that travel here frequently. A trespasser that got his due from someone he crossed. Well, I suppose I did not end and it did not end in death. But it was a mighty battle regardless. Do not know who the aggressor was, but I know who lost. And who was this person? A mage of power, I am sure. Though not powerful enough in the end. A pity, too. He seemed intent on unearthing an artifact of old or some such. Interesting. To risk so much for exploration. He must have been seeking something very valuable indeed. Then I call rights to it. And no back talk from you, mage. I know your sort gets all grabby about such things. And his reward for his effort? Worse than death, even though he seemed willing to share. Imprisoned, magically confined in the cavern north of here. Pity. What was he looking for? Who attacked him? You would have to ask him that yourself. I know only what I have said. My apologies. So north of here is that cavern. Sounds like a good thing to go check out. A major... Is this Baloth, maybe? 
Kind of reminds me of something Bailoff some would do. Hey, not a concern. I'm waiting. I hope hey, do you want this gem? Thanks, buddy. What was that? Heard anything about those two people I'm looking for? Sorry, no. I have heard nothing more about them. I do not get involved in the affairs of the drow. I'm a simple trader. I'll go, I'll go then. All right. Uh, do you think we can rest here? Safely? I mean, they're staying here, right? Let's go ahead and try it. You came too late. Didn't I say you would come too late? You will learn to trust me. Don't be afraid. You are safe here. If you behave. I will show you what fills the void. What is now free. You are not Emmawin. She said she had not ha had any dreams like these. I lurk behind your soul in the very fiber of your being. I am the only thing left when mind and reason are stripped away. I will show you what you can be. What you can do. If you simply let yourself become what you are. I can show you all of this because I am within. I am what fills the void. I am you. Oh my god. You asked for it. Oh, I'll show you a fight. She's the slayer. Oh, I'll show you She's a killing fight. all my companions. You asked for it. You are to be given a gift. It is a valuable prize. One that you had better appreciate. You worry for your comrades, perhaps? Leave them, abandon them, and become what you must. There is great power in your heritage. Use it, and you will become closer to who you are. What you could be. Feel what is in the void. Use the tools that you are given. Become part of something greater. I am in you, and I know what is best. Each time you use it, each time you accept it, you move a little closer to the evil within. Perhaps you lose yourself in the end, but you will go to greater reward than you can know. After all, what does an eternity of nothingness matter when you can destroy all that would oppose your development as easy as one? Hmm. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Godlike, increasing the tribute score to 25. What? Saravak was immune to my damage. Who's that? Three. Body. And this is Aranicus. Four. And Emowyn. Hmm. It's, uh... Hmm? Healing spells cast. Helix can now change into the Slayer at will. Slayer change. Hold on. Let me uh, pause it first. Oh, it is paused. Okay. When you use this ability, you take on the form of the brutal essence of Baal, a violent, powerful creature made of teeth and claws. Using this ability reduces your reputation by two points, as even those who do not witness the event can sense the corruption caused by giving yourself over to instinct. The Slayer form grants the following benefits. Strength and Dexterity set to 25. Effective AC set to 9, minus 9. Magic Resistance to 40%. Saving Throws set to 2. Is that good? That sounds bad. <laughs> Attacks per round set to 4. 1d8 crushing and 2 cold. Thacko set to 0. 100 hit points. Immunity to imprisonment, level drain, stun, and missile attack. Oh boy. That sounds really nice. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> kind of want that. Oh man. This is setting up like like what she's talking about there and like what she showed in that dream kind of sets up the potential for a very interesting choice for Heliax, right? Because if it comes down to two choices, the one choice being, you know, the power of a god 
essentially. Which is something he's really would love to have. Or his friends. Right? The dynamic behind him is like he will do anything for power except to hurt his friends so far. But what if it's like unlimited power or your friends? How much temptation can he resist for the love of his friends? I don't know. That 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 could be an interesting uh, decision if that's something that's offered to him. I don't know. But we are well rested now. Everybody's at full health. We got our spells back. We are ready to explore the Underdark. So let's go ahead and do it. So we got some uh, Mind Flayers up above. We probably should go handle them. But want? I want to explore this region as best I can first. So let's go ahead and put Improved Invisibility on Heliax. And he's going to go look around. Okay, we got an air elemental up here. As well as some sort of portal. And that looks like a dead end there. What do we got going on over here? Miner's spell turning. We got some drow somewhere. Earth elemental here. So we got an air elemental and an earth elemental both guarding a portal. So it looks like we're gonna have some elemental bullshit going on. I just realized those are buildings, aren't they? There's a drow priestess. Got a bunch of spores. Oh my god. I've been spotted. That's really bad. <laughs> How'd they see me? Oh, he, he, he dispelled me. That drow bastard. Oh, God. Everybody's going to attack me now. Oh, he's really quick. All right. Well, we're going to get over here. And my friends are going to help me out. Taking care of the earth elemental. Are the others going to come after me? I wonder if they're attacking the spores now. That'd be kind of nice. Alright, they're using up a lot of their spells right now though. So if they don't come and attack me, that'd be great. Let's go kill the air elemental. Are they actually not supposed to be in the front? Good. Oh, another one. Oh, do they keep coming? The shimmering portal reveals a twisted landscape obscured by large shadow like forms. Next way. Here, my spells would Next serve time. better. This weapon Next is useless. Way. Okay. They keep coming. Why are they attacking Corgan? I mean, we're getting 7,000 each time we kill them, so I don't really mind this. Let me just grind this. <laughs> oh, shit. I didn't even realize how low you were. Give me some direction. Um... Jacques. Trust us. Oh, I'll show you a fight. It's really bad that we are that low already. You were lucky then, but luck runs out. I don't know. Are they just going to keep on attacking? If it must be done. Wow, they are doing a lot more damage than I thought they would. My spell would serve better. This weapon is useless. Hmm. What's the trick here? Yeah. My spell will serve better. All right, back up. We don't want to fight this thing infinitely. It has to be something we can do here. 
My talents Next are wasted swing. on ha! physical blows. I'll rip you apart, you okay. So we've already taken a significant amount of damage. Are you? Do you have the thing that regenerates you? I think you do. So you should be fine. Yeah. Okay. So how do we take care of those guys? I mean, we got a lot of XP from that. I mean, that's a thousand XP for everybody each time, just about. A little more than that. Who's next? Edwin. He's only 16,000 away. That's amazing. Give me some day. Okay. Concern. Well, let's ignore that one for now, I suppose. <laughs> hmm. We want to aggro Stop, this guy. I shall follow your strength. So it comes over here. But we don't want to go against the drow, too, so. Yeah, it's that good. Anything that gets in our way will be buried in this place as is worth it. Okay. Um. Okay, we could go up to the drow, it looks like. I was wondering if they were on, like, a platform or something. You asked for it. And they are really going in. Where are you going, Edwin? What is it if I must? Alright. I need to zoom in. I can't really see what's going on here. Okay, that's one down. Move to this priestess. Okay, they're trying to charm us. It's not working yet, but... Okay, it's another one down. Keep moving. We all right back here? Yeah. Okay, they're not super strong, so that's good. Let me move to this thing. Okay. Good. That wasn't so bad. Take all these. We're gonna take all of it, but... All right, let's go ahead and identify this chainmail. Chainmail plus three. Wait, oh, that's actually really good. The delicate yet sturdy craftsmanship of the elven races allows them to design many beautiful yet utilitarian goods. Among these is elven chainmail, which is so finely wrought that it can be worn under normal clothing without revealing its presence. This and its lightness allows it to be worn by thieves and fighter mages with few restrictions. This item, like most draw equipment, is created using adamantine, an alloy of adamantite that quickly turns to dust if removed from the underdark. Interesting. This magical drow chain mail gives the wearer a bonus of 5% to magic resistance and takes one off of the speed factor of all spells cast by the wearer of this armor. Wow, this is really good. Look at that. Hmm. I mean, my head and shadow won't be as good. Or my move silently won't be as good. Actually, yeah, I mean, it won't be as good. Man, this is better than the knight's gift, huh? Hold on. I think this is still lighter. What's the weight? Five. Twelve. Yeah. Still. I think you could wear this too, couldn't you? Oh, I guess we gotta give it to you first. Could you wear this? You can't. Damn. So I bet this stuff is pretty uh expensive. I guess we wanna keep this for when we leave the the underdark. Assuming we do get out of here. Alright. Uh, you can't carry all this, so give it to Viconia. Yeah, it's not better than what you're wearing. Okay, cool. 
So we, I know we've got some spore colonies still down here that we need to take care of unless the drow took them, took them down. Let's save it. Move on over here. Yeah. I'll send you to the abyss. All right, move you to this one. To I'll send you to the abyss. More drow. Shit. Move back, move back. All right, kill these guys. Okay, back up. Edwin. I will tolerate only so much. Cast a fireball in there. Nishru. I keep backing up. Owie. Drink a potion. Leave me be. Drink a potion. Are you poisoned? I think Edward might be poisoned. Yeah. Uh can I drink an antidote to get rid of that? All right, all of you on this guy. Oh. No. That's a good. I will tolerate only so You know the fireball over here. Holy crap, these guys are strong. Name it. All right, all of you on this thing. I don't know what it is, but get on it. Ready and willing. Got gotcha. darkness, fool. Something up. Good to go. Okay. Man, they are really hell bent on getting over here, huh? Okay, we got it. There's another one. I feel your stairs die, die. Okay. Potion. Leave me be. Okay. Were those summoned things? They might have been summoned things. There's another drow. Kill him. Good. 11,000 XP for killing a drow. Okay. Back on this guy. Okay, and then up here. Every second I am in this form. I will listen for now. Alright, the colony's dead. Give me Turn to these action. things. Taste the glory. Now you die. No mercy for those who are poisoned. Okay. Phew. It's done. Yeah, the Underdark is tough. I Holy crap. To command. Go ahead and use a mask here. Okay. Save it. I'm Wasn't there another drow? Yeah. You asked for it. Holy crap, man. That spell is really strong. Yeah. What is it? Yikes. Victory shall be ours. There's another mask here. Wasn't the, weren't there illithids here? Oh, I guess we can't get there. Should we go kill the illithids? Destiny We will. We will do that. Just not right now. I need to rest again. Holy crap. <laughs> A lot of damage. Alright. Hello? Oh, there's a... Oh, no, 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 no. I didn't want to do that. Go back. What is this? 
It's probably best left to me. Western tunnel. Okay. Yeah, we don't know what these portals are. Hey, hey not a concern. Um, Viconia, drink another potion. And you should I'm probably worried. drink another one of these fortitude things. Just to be safe here. Yeah. There you go. I hope this is worth it. Hello. Mm, yes. I do odd Gulver Detonian. Da sud Sugden Ostera. I'm sorry, but your meaning escapes me. Stop your grunting and speak common, deep gnome. Uh, your meaning... Yeah, I don't know. I don't understand you. Ahem. You there. You who are there. Stand and identify yourself and your purpose. Heliax, and I'm not here to cause trouble. I come in peace, as they say. There's no need for your hostile tone. Perhaps we can do something... Perhaps we can do some trading. Who I am in is none of your business. Let me pass. My purpose? My purpose is disposing of little annoyances like you. Perhaps we can do some trading. Hmm. You are not a resident of this place, are you? Strangers from above, then? Come here, you should not. Though useful, you may be. You may enter, but on your best behavior be. Go and speak to the lord of our fair granite home. He will see to your well-being. And know this. I see the darkness you travel with. Friends of the drow, we are not. But we will tolerate her here for now. Respect our peace. There are few drow that come this way peacefully. Alright, I met the leader of the guards for a small village. Of, uh, as, whatever they're called. As, uh, Vernoblin. <laughs> uh... He advised that I may pass through as I wish, so as long as I speak with their leader first. Okay. A friendly village might be worth going to check out, like, immediately. So let's go, let's go there now. Is this going to be on the same map? I thought we were going to get, like, a, um... Like a... a a travel thing. Mind your toad. Give me some direction. Yeah, I'll see to it. it. Looks like they have that little mine village here. A lot of rings around. Surely they don't mind me taking this stuff. What do they need rings for? Okay. Is it right up here, maybe? Shuttily made and subtly maintained. But good killing grounds, then. Um, hello. I'm looking for the deep known leader. Do we know the name of the guy? I'll be right with you, sir. That looks like a bedroom. Oh, there's the innkeeper. Dagglefod. Okay. Um. Maybe this guy is the leader, then. Hello? Anybody else in here? Got all this loot. Hi. Ah, uh, travelers to our fair city. That would be rare enough, but you are surfacers by the look of you. Come, I would have words with you. If you are willing to hear. Uh, speak and I will listen, though I'm not sure what I could do for you. Another group of back tunnel weaklings need my help. What a surprise. I'm willing to listen as long as it is gold that is speaking. I will trade your words. I need information about some fugitives I'm chasing. Yeah, I like that one. I will help as I can, but my matter takes importance. Too much Zerfnoblin blood has been shed over this already. I will give you details of the task first, and you may decide if you wish to accept. I tap rock that you will. How quaint. Get on with it. As you can see, our granite home village is quite empty. I have sent the majority to deeper climbs far from here. I, it was not. It was no longer safe, and it is our own fault. Is this the leader? He's speaking like a leader. We tunneled too deeply recently and unearthed a monstrosity, a strange cavern that yielded death, a monster we have not seen outside of dreaming. The task I ask of you is simple to explain, but difficult indeed. I ask that the beast be killed and the tunnel be closed. Could you not just collapse the tunnel upon the creature? 
You deep nose are supposed to be diggers. Why not bury it yourself? Hey, could you not just collapse it? The tunnel will readily collapse. Of that we are sure. What is unsure is whether that would kill the beast now that it is awakened. Uh, awakened? Please tell me that you mean it was hibernating and not otherworldly. As I said, it is a beast out of dreams or nightmares, if you prefer. It is not of the rock. I do not know what to call it. The goal is clear enough. Now I must mention what I will need from you. Yeah, number one. I am listening, but keep in mind that we are not the richest of granite no granite homes. We are under constant pressure, with the drow being, being so close. I require no payment for helping others, but I seek two surfaces that came this way. You will pay me? Yeah, we want... I don't really care about money at the moment, which is out of character a little bit for Heliax, but he is desperate to get his soul back. So he can have the power to choose whether or not to be the Slayer or not. Right now, it's like, it's going to happen if I don't get my soul back. I'm going to die, become that, lose control. I think that would be the one caveat to the to the offer of unlimited power. Is if he can't control it, he doesn't want it. Right? Because lack of control. Would he believe that? Now I'm thinking, you know, maybe he's more lawful evil. <laughs> but no, I mean, I don't think chaos necessarily means you want to be out of control controlled chaos right i don't know but he needs to find eranicus surfacers other than you ah i know of them but you will have a hard time finding them they pass within the city of the drow usnatha now before you ask i may know a way into the drow city well i know a being that might help help you she could see you safely inside but after that you would surely be dead no offense mala drow but I see you do not wear the symbols of any house that I know. You would fare no better. Th you would fare no better in there, especially with your current companions. What good is that? What good is this indigo she beast if she is if she is as much a target down here as the rest of us? Trust me, Corgan. You would not want us to vote on your wrath. You would not want us to vote on your worth any more than you should speak about hers. You hear that, Vico? The little girl protects you. Ah, she's got a nickname, Vico. Indignity after indignity. Get on with get on with your safe alternative, Goldander. If such is the risk you would take, I will gladly point you in her direction. The great staircase goes to her lair. It is the blackest of all the tunnels, but there is glorious light on the other on the other side. She is called Adelon by choice, though my lady will suffice just as well. Show respect and you will have it in return. He's giving this, inform this information before we even help him out. That's kind of bold of him. Although Dark Tunnels at the end of a long staircase always reminds me of... Um, I forget the name of it, but the spider in Lord of the Rings. <laughs> Gives me chills to this day. I don't need you. I don't need you if she knows about the two I seek. And have a way to get... Yeah. Is she, if she is so powerful, why don't you get her to help you? Why use me? What manner of creature is this Adelon? Is she a uh, deep gnome like you? Oh, goodness, no. She is a creature of great beauty, as you will hopefully see. She does keep very particular company, though. More so than others of her kind. I'm sure she will see to your concerns if you approach politely. But I fear I must restrict your access until the needs of my village are met. Of course. Selfish in your generosity, admirable. The passage to her lair is guarded against intruders by a force of her design. It is the blackest of a dark, preventing even the drow entry. When the beast in the cavern is dispatched, I will give you a light gem to banish the darkness of the tunnel. I carry it with me always, but I will gladly give it to you for this service. Saying that was a mistake, fool, I will kill you and take the stone. Forget your deal. I will help you, but you will pay me more than that. Now, where must I go? Fair enough. Where must I go to find this beast you need killed? I'm very interested about this beast. Otherwise, I might have just killed him. I guess we can kill him and still handle the beast. Yeah, but we want a place to sleep, too. I think that's another big factor. Is we need a safe haven here. Fair enough. I'm glad of your decision. The passage is to the northeast, guarded by one of my best breach gnomes. He will let you pass now. Take this stone scape, stone shaped scroll. It is linked magically to the stone of the of the cavern. When the beast is dead, use this to bring the cavern down upon it. I shall make it a forbidden area forever forever after. 
Thank you, Heliax. You do not know the good you have done here. Yeah, no problem. I, I, all I do is good. I'm a good guy. All right, so we know there's an innkeeper over there. I don't necessarily think we need to rest quite yet. But let's take a look around here. Is there anything else in this place? Scroll of identify. A locked chest. Yeah, I'm there. With a ring in it. Ooh. What do we got? The discipliner. Off the bane of the careless mage, this ring was actually used to promote humility. Hergit Norin, a grand wizard of Nar Narfo, would give the discipliner to his most skilled and most egotistical students. Through their blind arrogance, they would mistake the ring as a reward for their obvious brilliance, and not the punishment of a disapproving teacher. Intelligence and wisdom score set to three, and it's cursed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good stuff, good stuff. Give that to you, that to you. Over here, over here. Okay. Give me if it must be done. Looks like there's something down here. Another scroll. Emma Wink can learn it. A level one scroll. I'm waiting. It's probably Have we lost to people? No. What is 6,800 left for you. Yeah. We could go kill a handful of air elementals and get her leveled up. Hello. I have been informed of the permission given. You may pass into the depths if you wish, though I worry for the dangers you may face. Oh, this is the way to the the evil guy, huh? Let's take a little look in here. Okay, yeah, it looks like there's some steps down. We'll go there shortly. We'll probably rest before we go there. This is pretty cool. I like this. Um, a dead end over here. Okay. And it looks like that's the entirety of this city. Um, what do we want to go check out before we leave? Do we want to go try and kill the Illithids before we rest? Yeah, I think there's somebody else over here. And I think we will go kill the Illithids before we rest. I might wrap up the episode too. We have all these chests and cabinets we could loot. But we don't want to risk angering them until we get everything we need from them. There's the innkeeper. Yeah, there's another guy in here. Ferndol Danglefod. Danglefod. There we go. Mm, At Gossel yes. Tustun. Gossel? The Rot. Uh, I'm, I am interested in seeing what you have for sale. The store is closed today, outsider. I must search for my child before I trade a single gem. Bedlin Daglefod must be found. Uh, is there a reward for his return? Do you damn me too? I need supplies to survive. No one will find him if unprepared. Is there a reward? I expect no help from outsiders. I expect no help from outside the granite homes. You may say whatever, but it proves nothing about your true intent. Ah, the gripping helps nothing. This griping helps nothing, it don't. Here, let's do the blasted trades and be done with this. I have no time. Uh, thank you. I will look for your child when I can. Alright, okay, you got some magical armor here. Everything's a plus one. Interestingly. Not that I need that. Uh, you got potions of genius, you might steal those. You do get some scrolls as well. Anything that we need to learn? Edwin probably knows most spells by now. And Emmawin can learn all of this except for restoration. Holy crap. Okay. So we are going to be stealing from you for sure. Um, who's, Did we give those of Iconia? How much do you want for these things? Ah, these are really cheap. Oh, I didn't know there was we had drow full plate armor in here. Oh, we'll hold on just a moment. Wow, look at that. Minus 13. Holy shit. Full plate armor is the best armor. Blah, 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 blah. The drow armor will dissolve to dust the moment it is removed from the underdark. So 
It doesn't have anything else going for it. But I think it is better for you. Uh, this armor goes to you, actually. Isn't it better for you? Yeah. There you go. Gets you that charisma. And this is better armor for you. Saver spells, fire resistance, yeah. There we go. Everybody has switched armor. Luckily, it's one size fits all. Alright, go ahead and Give save that. Direction. Yep, so we gotta find his son, too. See inventory again. And we're going to rob you blind. Because she needs all of this stuff. So let's go ahead. Really? I got caught? I got caught. That's weird. Yes. I never get caught. Is this guy, like, impossible to steal from? Oh, this is worth yes. it. Huh. I guess I can't steal from this guy. Oh, well. Yeah. Okay, let's go kill those illithids. So we need to go back down here. Be careful with the elementals. I need to figure out how to close these elemental portals, too. I don't see, like, any other triggers. Hmm. My god, it's a long walk. <laughs> it's really cool how they're, like, built into the walls and stuff. I like that. This has been really fun so far in the Underdark. I think it's really cool. We're finally in like a non-human area. I don't think there are any humans in the Underdark, right? Isn't it like dark dwarves and then dark gnomes and then I guess deep gnomes and deep dwarves, duagar and elves, drow. Illithid. Yeah, very interesting. Alright, over here. Okay. We creep up here. And since we're gonna be resting soon, let's go ahead and try and use like our big spells here. So mass invisibility. Never before used. What is it now? I want spot deflection. What's your big abilities? Yep. Power word stun. It's on a creature, okay. Shadow door. We really need to go through your stuff before we sleep. Because your stuff isn't you don't really have like great stuff. Haste on everybody. And this should be good enough. Give me some direction. Alright, save it. Let's get in there. Yeah, I'll see to it. Wait, what? They're gone. Oh well shit. <laughs> I guess we'll explore a little bit around. Well done. Oh, there was nothing there. I thought those are stairs leading down there, but they're not. It's nothing. All right, well, I guess we'll look over here real quick. Oh, Emma Wynn can't be. She's got that ring. That's why it was never affecting her. Kith under Urdlingalas. Odflusdlindin. Hello. As you can pass into this realm of yours. Uh, that sounded far too hostile for my liking creature back or will be forced to harm you. God slash uh, I feel bad. Uh this isn't going to end well, is it? Okay. Yeah. 
From what Viconia said, the the Kuotobo are not like really good at are are very safe. Let's do this quick. I need to kill that wizard in the back. Your worthless lies in here. Here. Onto this guy before he kills Heliax. Holy shit, that's a lot of people. Okay. Move up. A lot more difficult than I thought. Edwin, are you out of darts? You're not, but you're not using them. Darts are stunning. Um, go and use chain lightning on them. And another one. I'll rip you apart, you way-faced cur. Yes, it is. Both time we got to business. All right, on to this guy. All of you. Phew. That was a lot of enemies. She still hasn't leveled up. I am your trust. All right. Do you have any more of these? You do. Use that on him. Excellent. Victory shall be ours. You know this. All right, uh, let's loot this place. Don't need the bolts. We'll take the gems and the scrolls, though. Anybody want this? You could use disintegration. Go ahead and identify that. You can learn this one too. Disintegration. Damn it. Oh, that's flesh and stone. That would have been a good one to get. Go ahead and use that to identify this. Oh, you don't need to. Well, never mind. Okay. Give me some direction. So mass invisibility did not work quite as well as I thought it might. It's a death scroll. Come on. Damn it. And put these in here. Oops. There, there you go. And put that on your bar. Save I'm it again. Ready, if it must be done. What do we got in, going on over here? Do we have like a whole village here that we gotta destroy? Eastern tunnels. Okay. That's probably where their home base is, huh? Who are these things? Oh, and some stairs going up to the southern tunnels. Okay. So we've got western, eastern, southern tunnels. Um, there should be northern tunnels somewhere, right? That's where the uh, one guy's trapped that they're talking about. The, the evil mage. Not evil mage, but the, the mage. Um, we should probably go rest, huh? Or do we want to explore the rest of this area first? Oh, it's kind of tough. What do I want to do? That magic missile? What the hell? A magic missile scroll. I haven't seen one of those in forever. It's probably best left to me. It used to be like the bread and butter spell. I mean, it's still useful at times. But... Okay, we can't make it through here. Let's just take a little peek, you know? See what's out here. It's a narrow passage here. With well constructed flooring. A drow war party. Oh no. Give me some direction. Let's see what your guts be looking like. Next swing. I think we're gonna need some help here. Mass invisibility. Uh powered stun on that one. Drink. I'm waiting. And then use that. Back here. 
from getting destroyed. Alright, all of you on this guy. Give me some direction. Drink again. I'm waiting. Back up. Summon this over here. Good job, guys. Get in on him. Okay, we're actually doing great. There we go. Oh, there's still more. Shit. Give me some direction. There we go. And we level up. Great. Great, great, great. Okay. We got a whole bunch of crap. Look at all this stuff, man. Yes, Abil. I will carry no more. Be quick with this ground for what I've Okay. I'm waiting. Yeah, I'll see to it. Got a ton of loot for Edmund to identify. All this drow equipment. I'll be no pack horse. Pick up your garbage where I dropped it. These are bolts. Okay. Pass them off to Dorn here. He can carry quite a bit, can't he? think so. Yeah, he can carry 500 pounds. He's a big boy. One of these shields are going to be better than what I'm using. Crossbow of speed. Drow longsword plus three. Damn, man. Some good stuff. Drow adamantine chain plus five. It's different than what I'm wearing, isn't it? Oh, yeah. So it has the... Pickpocket. Oh, that's all minus 20%. Is that what this is doing? Well, this is all minus... I'm going back with my old gear. I think maybe that's why uh, the one thing wasn't working. Get this off me. Nasty stuff. I will carry no more. You may scrounge. Although I she can wear this? Ground. Doesn't affect spellcasting, right? Oh, hell yeah. Don't put that on. Could you wear any... Wait, could you wear any of the uh, other stuff? Where is it? Camera oven chain. Can he wear this? Edwin. No. Okay. Hey, right, pass this stuff on. I'll be oh, I forgot to. Pack horse. Pick up your garbage where I dropped it. I if you should put everybody in this full plate stuff. I'll carry no more. It's beyond the ground if you want it back. It's actually a potentially a good idea. Um. Yeah, I mean, that's so good. Minus seven. I think we need to be using that. As much as I love this stuff. And we'll keep this. I mean, obviously, we need this stuff for when we get to the surface. So, we'll go ahead and give all those to Heliax. He can put them away in his bag. There we go. Those shields. Let me see. It is a better shield in terms of armor. Does protect against missiles. Doesn't have the immunity to charm, confusion, domination, hold, though. I think we'll keep this shield. Yeah. All right, Edwin leveled up. All right. Two level eight spells he got. That's big. Only one hit point. That's... You know, what can you do? What can you do? Alright, so this is the first level 8 spell we get. Got some good stuff in here. Oh, man. Simul simulacrum. Simulacrum. However you say it. That could be really good. Oh, man. Maze is really good. 
Summon Fiend. Symbol of Stun, Symbol of Death. Is a powerful enchantment that allows the wizard to inscribe a symbol on the ground or any other surface. The symbol will remain there until someone comes too close, at which point it will explode, causing all those within the area to make a save versus death or die. Creatures with more than 60 current hit points are immune to this effect. That could be a really good strategy to combine that with like a fireball or like web fireball and then symbol of death. Because if they get webbed, we could potentially do multiple fireballs. Or even like fireball and fireball. We're gonna get one of those. I wanna try it. I get the symbol Ooh, a symbol of stun. Fireball, 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 and then symbol of death. I don't know. We have a way to take out an entire party, granted it's all by level eight spells. What are these? Not really actually, it's only two of them. We want that one. Where's Pierce Shield? A massive attack at an enemy wizard's spell defenses. The target's magic resistance will be lowered by 10% plus 1% per level of the caster. Next, Pierce Shield will cancel one spell protection of any level. For example, if the spell was cast by a 15th level wizard, the target's creature, target creature would lose 25% magic resistance from its current total, reducing it to zero if less than that remains, as well as canceling one spell pit protection of the mage's... Blah, 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 blah. That's kind of cool. I do think Maze could be interesting. The sim summon Fiend, I think, is probably the way to go. Power Blind could be really good, too, though. A full foot radius. Those cast one or more creatures within the air. If I become sightless. Spellcasters. The spellcaster selects one creature as the target center. And the effect spreads outward from the center, affecting all within a four foot radius. This lasts for six rounds or until dispelled. All this. Get Summon Fiend. There you go. You got more of these too, right? Mm, let's get Delayed Fireball Blast. Ooh, that's another like trap card kind of thing. Yeah, I like those. I think I like those. We haven't actually tried them yet, so. And then here, I think we want another Chain Lightning. Though it feels like Chain Lightning isn't doing that much damage, but still. It's a nice uh, targeted enemy effect damage dealing spell. You know, words. <laughs> All right, so for you, since we're here, let's go ahead and set your spells. Because, yeah, you don't have any there. What is this one? Mass Invisibility. Okay, I like Mass Invisibility, so it stays. Improved Taste. What is Improved Taste? This effect creates... This, the affected creatures function at double its normal movement and attack rate and receives a plus two bonus initiatives. There are three major differences between the third level wizard spell haste and this spell. First, there's no period of fatigue following the ex expiration of the spell. I didn't even know that that happened with the regular one. Uh, second, the spell will only affect one creature. Okay, that's a little worse. Third, this spell actually doubles the number of attacks per round of the hasted creature. Spell also negates the effects of slow. Hmm. I mean, I guess we'll get that. I guess so. I think that could be useful. And I think we'll get Stone to Flesh for that. Get rid of Shadow Door. Never going to use that. I can get rid of that too. Never going to use that. This summons this Phantom Blade, right? Oh, no, the wielder. She wields it. Okay. Don't necessarily want that. This book is a skeletal wardrobe. This is a wizard casting level. So we'd get one of these, right? It could be good. Sure, and that kind of goes with her darkened mood of late. Nah, I don't really want that. I don't really want it. I think we'll just get three more monster summonings. She'll be our summoner. Get another improved invisibility here. Uh, get rid of those. We'll keep the haste. And then three more fireballs. And then here... 
Get rid of all of those. We'll pick new ones. Um, get some webs, a strength, a stinking cloud, and two stinking clouds, yeah. Now we haven't used stinking cloud yet, but... Okay, and in here, I think we're just going to get all magic missiles. There we go. Okay. Yeah. I'm a little nervous of continuing forward at this point. Those drow. Um. Ooh. All right, let's go see what it is. We'll end the episode by exploring this little section. I was going to end it by resting, but we're here. I want to see what's up here, so... Hopefully there won't be too many more enemies. Okay, so we got a dark cave. I think that's what they were talking about with the uh, one dude, right? The mage, the powerful mage. Okay, a drow. All right, he's got he's he's leading us into a trap, surely. The massive gate to the drow city is closed to outsiders. Only drow have access to city within. I shall follow oh. your strength. I thought for sure she'd be able to unlock it. Okay. So that's the drow city. To Ustnatha. Alright guys. Well that's where we're going to end this episode. We've explored the first section of the Underdark we can go to. Next episode we'll probably go back to the gnome place. Rest. And then we'll do their quest where we go out and explore other things. But until then, I hope you all have a wonderful day, and I'll catch you later.